Dembury TV. Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of Dem Bulls. If you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button so you won't miss out on any updates from my channel. So we're going to be doing something new on this channel called MVP of the Week, which means that we're going to pick a player to highlight and a player who has really been performing over the last couple of games or a player who just is not talked about more enough. And as you guys can see from the title's video, our first MVP of the week is going to be Ryan Archdiakono. So last night, Ryan Archdiakono had a career high of 22 points. He was 8 for 12 from the field and came in when we really needed yesterday late in the fourth quarter with four May threes. Even though we lost, Ryan was the only player who kept us in the game and would have hit the game winning shot if there was more time on the clock. Ryan has really stepped up since Chris Dunn has been out with his injury and has become a reliable player to count on. Before the season started, Ryan played in the G League, signed to a two-way contract with the Bulls. He was not a player a lot of fans thought was going to have a breakout season, but he is definitely on his way. A lot of players have benefited from the star players getting injured, and Ryan has definitely been one of them. In the beginning of the season, we was trying to figure out who was going to be that backup point guard spot, and we were supposed to go to Cameron Payne, but we all know how that turned out. Ryan outplayed Cameron Payne and proved that he wanted to be a starter while Chris Dunn was out. The great thing about Ryan is his awareness on the court, forcing turnovers, offensively he's great, plays good defense, and he's not afraid of contact. Ryan was not a player who I thought we would be talking about a lot this season, but you can just really tell that he's hungry. And even though the Bulls are in a tough spot right now with their losing streak and injured players, it is nice to have a player like Ryan out there being really aggressive and trying to win games, even though we're shorthanded. So hopefully you guys like this type of content. Make sure you leave your comments below about Ryan Archidiakno. Are you guys impressed with him like I have been? In my last couple of videos, you guys know I had campaigned for him to start and now he's finally starting. So leave your comments about Ryan and make sure you leave your ideas of things that you want to see on this channel and make sure you're subscribed and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching.